This video will go over Dispatch in SCORM Cloud. Once logged in, click the Library tab, select the course, click Share, and select Dispatch. You can add more courses to a dispatch. If you've already created one before, you can add the dispatch to an existing destination or create a new destination. And a destination is an identifier for you to report on. Tags can be entered here. These can be used for advanced filtering and reportage. You can enter any notes, click Save, click Create. This will take you to your dispatch page. Here, you can disable, enable, add tags. I will link to an article about instance versus static registrations. And most importantly, you'll have your three options on how to share your dispatch. If you are dispatching to a LTI-supported LMS, you can click the BLTI button, and this will expose the URL key in secret. If you are dispatching to a pen-supported LMS, you can click Publish, enter the required information, and click Publish. The most common way to share a dispatch is to click Download, and this will export a simple SCORM 1.2 proxy file that can be import into any SCORM 1.2 compliant LMS. Additionally, you can click on a dispatch. For more options, click Edit. You can enter more tags, add any notes here. You can enable it or disable it, open or close it, add a registration cap, see a current registration count, and set an expiration date. Back on the dispatch page, you can click reports to see high level information on who has been accessing the dispatch. You can also export this information. If you have any questions, you can send an email to support at scorm.com.